and Lola and I'm going to explain how to calculate the trigonometric ratios of an angle. This side, C, this side is going to be A and this side is going to be B. This side is the hypotenuse. This side is the opposite and this side is the adjacent. If we want to calculate the hypotenuse, we have to use the hypotenuse formula, which is C squared is equal to A squared plus B squared. to the angle alpha and the adjacent leg is adjacent to the alpha angle. We are going to calculate the sine, the cosine and the tangent of alpha. To calculate the sine of alpha we have to divide the opposite for the hypotenuse. To calculate the cosine, we have to divide the adjacent for the hypotenuse. And to calculate the tangent, we have to divide the opposite for the adjacent. Calculate the cosecant, the secant, and the cotangent. To calculate the cosecant, we are going to divide the hypotenuse for the opposite. To calculate the secant, we are going to divide the hypotenuse for the adjacent. To calculate the cotangent, we are going to divide the adjacent for the opposite. So, in this angle, we know that the hypotenuse is 1.3 meters and that the adjacent is 1.2 meters, but we don't know uh, the value of the opposite. So we are going to calculate the value of the opposite. To calculate it, we need to use the hypotenuse formula. Now we just need to replace C and B with the information that we know already. C which is the hypotenuse, is 1.3 meters. A, which is the opposite, is the number that we want to calculate, and B is the adjacent, that is 1.2 meters. Now we just need to calculate. A squared is equal to 0 0.25. Now we have to do the square root of 0 0.25 and we obtain 0 0.5. That means that the opposite is 0 0.5 meters. Now we are going to calculate the sine, the cosine and the tangent of alpha. To calculate the sine we are going to divide the opposite which is 0 0.5 by the hypotenuse, which is 1.3 and we obtain 0 0.38 to calculate 
de cosine the adjacent by the hypotenuse we obtain 0.92 and to calculate the tangent we are going to divide the opposite by the adjacent and we obtain 0 0.32 now we are going to calculate the cosecant the secant and the cotangent. To calculate the cosecant of alpha, we have to divide the hypotenuse by the opposite. So we're going to divide 1.3 by 0 0.5. And we obtain 2.6. To calculate the second of alpha, we are going to divide the hypotenuse by the adjacent. So we are going to divide 1.3 by 1.2. And we obtain 1.08. And to calculate the cotangent, we're going to divide by the opposite. We obtain 